I think of drawing as a way of seeing. It helps me to see the world in a certain way, to pay attention to details. I love the freedom of it, being able to draw whatever I want to draw. It's an opportunity for me to explore the things that I love. I'm Jonathan Case. I'm a cartoonist. I work on titles like Batman for DC, and I've also done a bunch of graphic novels. For me, comics is an art form that allows expression visually, verbally. I love being able to inhabit a character, place them in a scene, and get that interaction happening, and just be a part of the entire process. I started drawing when I was about two years old, and I got into comics as a way to tell the stories that I wanted to tell with basically no budget. You know, all I needed was paper and pens and all the stuff that I've been using since I was a little kid. I do almost everything on an Intel-based tablet like this these days. My first book, Dear Creature, is about an atomic sea mutant in the 60s who has a poet soul at odds with his desire to eat people. So he's conflicted. He has three little crabs that live on his body and they say, don't worry about this love stuff, just eat the delicious people. But he wants to aspire to something better. He wants to find love. He knows everything about humans from Shakespeare and iambic pentameter. <laughs> he speaks that way. My next graphic novel after Dear Creature was called Green River Killer, a true detective story about a detective who was on this case for about 20 years tracking a notorious criminal. Stephen King gave us a great quote. He said that the first few prologue pages were the scariest thing that he'd read in years. To have somebody with so much clout come out and say, you know, this is something of value, this is, this is worth your time, that's a good feeling. Intel-based tablets work into my workflow because they have a lot of power. I can take it all the way from conception to printable, deliverable art on one platform. It's great because it keeps me mobile. I can take it to an ad agency. I can take it on the bus with me. If I need that option, I have it. Normally, I would print out my really tight pencils and ink over that because I need really established guidelines. When I'm working digitally, I can just work over something that's really loose and not worry about making a mistake with the inks because I can make a stroke and then undo it if I need to. So I can essentially be more in mind of just drawing. And that's something I would never be able to do with analog inks, of course. So basically, I can be in charge of everything from those loose conceptual drawings through the final color, print-ready artwork, and deliver that to the client, email it from the device. It all takes place on the Intel-based tablet, and everybody's happy. If you can find that thing that you, you get lost in and can just do for hours, then try to make a career of it, and that's kind of what I've done.